reliable journalist Fabrizio Romano has confirmed that Alexis McAllister is on the verge of completing his move to Liverpool from Brighton and Hove Albion. Romano used his Here We Go trademark announcement to tweet that McAllister's deal from Brighton and Hove Albion to Liverpool is all but finalized. With the player due to complete his medical in the next 24 to 48 hours after both sides and the Argentine reach a full agreement on the contract. The signing of the World Cup winner will please Jogan Klopp, who has been desperate to bolster his midfield as his side looked to improve on their fifth place if finished in the Premier League last season. And Roman has confirmed that the Anfield outfit will pay the buyout close in the new few days, which is way less than the reported 60 million partial fee. Alexis McAllister to Liverpool, here we go. The 24 years old looked emotional after he played his final game for the Seagulls, and he will be missed at the IMAX as the midfielder scored 10 goals and registered to assist in his 35 Premier League appearance as he helped them secure a top 6 finish, which will see them play European football for the first time in their history. Now that Liverpool have almost officially completed the signing of the Argentina International, club can shift his attention to adding more reinforcements to the middle of the pitch. And there are two names that the chairman is reportedly hoping to sign. Who else are Liverpool targeting for their midfield? According to Romano, Liverpool have started conversations with the agents of Manu Kone, 22, who plays for German side Borussia Mönchengladbach, and Kevin Turam, 22, of Nice, who are the two names that club is allegedly interested in. As for transfer market, the two midfielders are worth a combined 53 million parcelling, but it's unlikely the Reds will sign both, but stranger things have happened in football. Gabriel Figa, 21, is another player that the Reds appreciate. But according to Romano, there has not been a bit bad for all talks between the clubs and the South Africa players' representatives. From the edge profiles of the players that Liverpool are looking to recruit, it is clear to see that they are looking to bolster their midfield with threats, young and energetic midfielders who can implement the high-pressing game that brought home Liverpool's sixth European Cup back in 2019, and ended their 30 years away to become English champions under their charismatic manager. Till I get up, time is barely on our side